Disgusted by cyberbullies who prey on underage girls, Edie Mermelstein took down a website owner who engaged in sextortion. He threatened my client publicly in a tweet and said, I'm going to spam your floppy titties all over the place. That's indelible. Anytime there's something on the internet, it becomes indelible. Edie's client, 19-year-old Alyssa Backlund, became the target of death threats and hate mail after Christopher Stone posted a lewd sexual photo of a minor and misidentified that teenager as Alyssa. I looked at all the facts and I determined that the November 2009 incident where Mr. Stone had posted my client's personal information attached to that salacious, horrible picture of the teenage mother, that that was a defamation case that I could file against him. Edie filed a civil suit against Stone for abuse of process, among other claims, and an appellate court found the website owner's practices were abusive and unethical. I ended up getting a judgment for my client. It will be very difficult to collect because the guy's gone underground, which is a great thing for internet users everywhere because he's not prevalent on the internet. He's been quelled. We also got injunctive relief so that he can't defame anybody on the internet. 